An Indian takes on William Shakespeare. That's interesting. Hey everybody. So I'm doing a trailer reaction for a movie called Zolf... Zolfakar. Zolfakar. And apparently from what I saw it's an adaptation of a mix of two William Shakespeare plays, uh, one Julius Caesar and also uh, Antony and, and Cleopatra. But it's like a current representation of it, kind of what we've done out here with some of Shakespeare's stuff also with like Romeo and Juliet and stuff. So uh, yeah, that would be interesting. I would be interested to see what they do with that. This one I, I guess is supposed to come out in October around October I'm not sure it's supposed to come around during Durga Puja for 2016 which when I looked what that was was a festival that Hindus I guess a lot of Hindus follow and it happens around October in 2016 I don't know much about that festival but I'm kind of curious I'm gonna read up on it I, I like finding I like learning about these little things these little details of all these different holidays and stuff so that, that that's really interesting that this movie is going to take place around that holiday so let's watch Zulfikar and see what they got for us and then we'll talk about it after <laughs> I like the tattoos. This Pooja. That's what I was talking about, guys. Okay, I am feeling that. What I'm what I'm liking about it is they're so they're setting up it's a crime drama, which totally fits with all of William Shakespeare's works. <laughs> if you make it a crime drama, it fits in William Shakespeare's work. But uh, I like some of the cinematography. I'm wondering where they're doing the quick to slow mo, or the quick to real time where they're moving the camera and it's like a quick movement and then they bring it slow down and you get to see the full shot. If they're doing that for effect in the trailer and they're just speeding up part of the actual camera movement that's going to be in the movie or if the director actually directed those scenes like that. I personally don't like the whole fast to move and then quick or slow-mo into it. I'm not a big fan of that. I don't think you need to do it. I think they're only doing it in the trailer though. So that's what I'm hoping. I would prefer the director to do more of the grandiose shots like I've seen in the trailer without the whole quick to move up and then slow down parts. I would like to just have the full shot because I think that would have a lot more impact on what was going on and the beauty of the shot itself. So I would, I would like to see that. Uh, we didn't get any story. This is just a teaser. But if you've read Julius Caesar or Antony and Cleopatra, I mean, obviously it's going to be about someone that gets high up in the ranks of the mob or the, the, the crime syndicate that they're dealing with. And his... Uh, 
lieutenant or whatnot is going to fall in love with a woman and the guy is probably going to die at the end when Caesar gets you know taken out at two Brutus <laughs> but it it looks like an interesting movie and I would like to see those two those two storylines come to play in, a, in an Indian movie that would be interesting to me and I like the way it's shot I like the color scheme I love the visuals I would like more of the story of how they're going to present the story I would like to see how they want to present the story so when the trailer full trailer comes out you guys need to tell me about it you need to tell me about the full trailer because I want to see that comment below let me know what you think are you excited for this movie are you eh? are you whatever what are your thoughts what do you think about them uh, you know the the creators taking William Shakespeare and turning it into a crime drama do you like it when they make current movies based on old works I think it can work because William Shakespeare works for any time period uh, but if you're going to do an actual William Shakespeare movie you can't do it during current times I don't think it really works that well so if you want to take a straight adaptation of William Shakespeare you need to make it a period piece but if you want to use the storylines and the characters as a base for a current crime drama I think it can work and I think this might work but let me know like share subscribe tell your friends and I will see you on the next video